Over the last few years, the Lycoming Mall has lost several businesses and only a few still remain. Recently, the mall was purchased by a company that plans to redevelop the space. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Allen has more about the multi-million dollar grant that will secure the future of the mall. The Lycoming Mall in Muncie was once booming with life and shoppers. For years, many shops inside have left and the building was up for sheriff's sale. As a result, probably of COVID, uh, I think that uh, shopping has changed significantly. Uh, and I think that what's happened at the uh, Lycoming coming mall is just reflective of that. Recently, it was purchased by a company called FamVest One LLC based in State College. We were excited to know that there was a developer out there who was interested in the property, interested in, in redeveloping it. And uh, we think it's a, a huge opportunity for Lycoming County. State representatives Joseph Hamm and Jean Yall advocated for funding for the mall and helped secure $5 million through the Redevelopment Assistance Capital Program. The senator and I uh, worked together to, to fight to get these dollars back to rural Pennsylvania, back to Muncie Township and Lycoming County. The developers are planning to transform the property and bring businesses back to the area. My understanding uh, in talking to the developer is that he wants a mixed use uh, of that 135 acres. So he's looking to bring in uh, commercial businesses, residential properties, office space. It'll be some time before we see these changes, but Senator Yall says they're looking forward to the project's impact on the region. Being a vital uh, business area and uh, provide a lot of opportunities for people to uh, uh, come and hopefully stay and uh, live in the area. In Muncie, Jasmine Allen, 2822 Eyewitness News. The state representatives say that it's too soon for a timeline on the project, but new construction should begin in 2023.